that jury jury again. Break! Holy smackers! Hmm. Got another belly in the back overhead suplex. Catch him really off guard there. There's the tiger suplex. One, two, three. And that's it. Kid Trustworthy is gone. That's eight superstars, ladies and gentlemen. Here's your winner, Tommy. And the ninth one is coming up, fans. The ninth wonder of the world, Pumpkin Escobar. That's that's not true. That's not true, though. He's not even the ninth wonder of the world. Here he comes, ladies and gentlemen. Representing the Black Wrestling League. And from Los Angeles, California, weighing 205 pounds. Los Angeles local 305. He is Pumpkin Escobar, who should have technically won the 2016 King of the Ring, but due to controversial circumstances, Pumpkin Escobar did not get his recognition, did not get his win, and as a result, got himself screwed, glued, and tattooed. But this is it, fans. The last round here in the Gone for the Gold, Tom Sever, Pumpkin Escobar, now. Here it is, ladies and gentlemen, the last straw. Tom Sever went through the entire gauntlet to get to this position, to get to this point against Pumpkin Escobar. What a hell of a gauntlet match it has been, fans. This has been by far one of the most intriguing, one of the most brutal gauntlet for the gold matches I have ever seen. Absolutely interesting, fans. Absolutely amazing performance here by Tom Sever, outlasting all eight stars, seven or eight stars in this match. Excuse me, fans. I've been making a, a big mistake here in this entire duration of this matchup here. Tom Sever has under seven stars, and this being the eighth one. It's like eight levels of Mario Brothers, pretty much, for Tom Sever. So that makes that Pumpkin Escobar is the Bowser of this round here in the gauntlet. Big hip toss, beautiful! The one that came ever so close was Ethan Mata to this very D, this very moment of this match. Everybody else has been a walk in the park, pretty much. Wow. Sever is just indestructible. He's virtually indestructible. He finally gets that leg lock submission hold he's been wanting this entire evening. Is Sever farting? Tom Sever is squatting right in front of Pumpkin Escobar. He got his ass kicked for that too. Scooper slams and the referee gets involved. Oh my god, did you see that? Pumpkin Escobar just got his ass chewed out. Oh no! Three! Oh no! Don't tell me we're gonna get another count out! Five. Come on! Give me a break! Six! Seven! Ah, uh, this Eight. is ridiculous! Nine! I can't believe this!
What's going on here? Tom Severs out cold. The power just went out. Tom Sever has got laid out somehow, some way, some fashion here. It's a strange promo video of the Russian enforcer. Wait a second. Wait a second. There's the Space Jam. Don't tell me we're seeing this. Rope break. The Russian Enforcer. What the hell does that mean? A snap power slam. Good grief. The Russian Enforcer. We have not seen that person in a very long time. Super nice snapmare takedown by Tom Stever. Look at this Break. submission hold. Uh, what the hell was that, fans? But Pumpkin Escobar somehow we're getting a second win here. This is the, almost the exact same thing that's happened at the King of the Ring. Oh my goodness! A bus saw kick. Going for a second one. Why was that interrupted though? What was all that about? One, two, three! Oh my god! Oh my god! Pumpkin Escobar scores the fall! Who? Who allowed that video to be inter to interrupt our broadcast? Why is the... What, what the hell is going on here? Ladies and gentlemen, I don't know what's been going on around here. We've seen an incredible, incredible gauntlet match where Tom Sever was just taking out everybody left, right, and center. Literally left, right, and center. But at the tail end, something happened. I thought for a second that Tom Sever was going to score the fall becoming the new FPW Gauntlet Champion by counting out Pumpkin Escobar. So a strange video occurred out of nowhere that wasn't even part of our format. I don't know who even leaked an information, I don't know even who even leaked a video like that, but the Russian enforcer, whom we haven't even spoken of, heard of, or seen since 2002, interrupts a beautiful match where Tom Sever was going to get all eight superstars defeated. But then what happened? Pumpkin Escobar somehow, some way, some fashion, gets right back up to his feet, gets in the ring, and we notice an unconscious, an unconscious Tom Sever in the ring. Pretty much just laid out there for Pumpkin Escobar to, to, to retrieve that victory. He didn't have to do anything. He got his ass beaten, gets back up, and then somehow manages to win. I am fucking pissed here. Tom Sever should have won this goddamn thing, and now he's being carried out by security, and we're getting all the security guards all over the building to find out if the Russian enforcer is even here. What do you have to deal with with Tom Sever? What kind of bone you gotta pick with Mr. America? You have no business being here. You're not even contracted to be here. So I want answers, and I want these answers now! Fuck! Check out the building and see what's going on. Ladies and gentlemen, before we go anywhere else, I want to tell you that we're going to go on to a 20 minute intermission and when we get back, we're going to get that conclusion of that women's tag team match in a sudden death situation where it's going to be contested in a tables match. You heard me right, 